CMOs are facing two major decisions in today's digital age. The first thing is they need to integrate a lot of different technology platforms in order to reach their audiences across all sorts of different devices, whether it be your iPhone or a tablet or your laptop. And they also need to ensure that these technologies deliver a return on investment. So R2I has two major divisions. The first one can evaluate, help a CMO purchase, and then integrate what we refer to as marketing cloud technology platforms. These are all the technologies that CMOs need in order to reach their audience. And then we also have a division that actually can turn these technology tools on and run what we refer to as demand generation programs. So we're part marketing cloud technology integrator and part marketing demand generation agency. About a year ago, we, we started to talk with a few investment banks. We ended up hiring a bank out of New York named Petsky Prunet, and we started to evaluate the idea of bringing on a new investor. They took us through a long process where we had many, many meetings. I think we had 20 different meetings in the Baltimore marketplace with a wide variety of different companies, from strategic investors to private equity partners. And we ended up choosing what we believe was the best private equity partner for us, which was Baird Capital out of Chicago. The process wasn't easy, but it also wasn't hard. It was an endurance test. That's the best way to describe the process. It took a lot of time and energy, but it really wasn't a difficult process. It was more of an endurance test. There are many top-notch agencies in the Baltimore metro area. What we wanted to do was to build a national company with offices all over the country, but with its headquarters in Baltimore, Maryland. So we feel that that is going to help the economy. We have a lot of notoriety now. We're one of the most advanced marketing cloud technology companies out there. So all these accolades and the idea of building a national company with its headquarters in Baltimore. That's what I've always wanted to do. The future is growth. We have a great private equity partner. We're probably going to do some additional acquisitions of like-minded businesses in different parts of the country and we want to grow this business and keep doing what we're doing.